That was beautiful. Annyeong, my people. Welcome back to my channel. Um, so today we are doing another Mamamoo video called Starry Night. This is because on the last video that I did, Egotistic, if you haven't seen it, go check it out. Um, I said if I could get 100 likes on a video, then that group is going to be done immediately afterwards. And <clears throat> I got a 100 likes on a few of them. So now we're up to Mamamoo again. Um, I'm really excited about this. I've done a little bit of research on the group. Um, I know who two of them are now. You know, everybody told me after I freaked out about Solar. I think that's how you said it. Solar or Solar? I don't know. Uh, last video, I kind of freaked out about how unbelievably beautiful she is. And everyone was like, yeah, this is her name. I didn't figure out how to say it, but uh, she seemed, she was the one with the, the voice that could just belt out and the looks that could just kill me dead in an instant. I learned that the rapper's name this is going to be so bad. Don't hate me. Moonbyol? I... Moonbyol? I, something like that. Uh, it's spelled like Moonbyol. I'm sorry to all the people that I just offended. I'm pretty amped about this. The last song that they did, it had kind of like a Spanish vibe to it. The video and the music itself. A lot of acoustic guitar. Uh, a lot of, you know, oranges and reds throughout the visuals. Uh, and I liked it a lot. And I know that these girls are capable of just singing their faces off, you know? I want to see what this rapper girl, Moonbyol, has for me. I want to see what Solar has for me. She's pretty. Go. Is the sound on? Oh, there it is. I think one of their names is... Oh, God, this is going to be so terrible. I'm going to offend all of the Koreans tonight, but... Hwasa? Hwasa? Pretend I didn't say that. So this is definitely... This is definitely one of the other ones that has more of, like, a Spanish vibe, I think. It's, there's another acoustic guitar back there. With a lot of slides. Echo on the guitar, too. Hmm, I don't know that one. I just woke up my Echo. Her name, I call her Echo, not Alexa. To avoid anybody else saying the word Alexa and... That falsetto is real nice there. She's the rapper, isn't she? She's singing a little bit here. I love this. This is what I wanted. I wanted to hear their vocals. There's very little percussion. The percussion fell out there. It's coming back in now, but... They're really showing off their uh, vocal range right now. There's a lot of quiet singing, but with, uh, you know, falsettos and... The visuals are really nice, too. But th this is this is the best their vocals have sounded uh, in any of the songs I've listened to yet. That's my girl, right? She's looking like, uh... She's looking like Daenerys a little bit there. The braids. Mm. Ooh, yes. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I wanted to hear. Now we got the rapper actually rapping a little bit here. Look at that visual, too. The shots are really beautiful in this one. Mm. Her range, too. Her high... Her, when she goes real high, it's just... She crushes it. It 
It's like the clearest water I've ever seen in my life. Yeah, that came out of nowhere. I thought it was about to... Ooh. Look at that. Beautiful. Damn, they're, they're all fantastic singers. This is... This is probably, uh, out of all the songs I've listened to so far, the one that shows off uh, vocal ability the most. And uh, I'm not gonna lie, I'm really impressed. Everybody calls them the vocal, uh, the vocal queens of K-pop. Wow, there's still more. This part's so random. I'm guessing it's an outro. This whole song has been really uh, creatively structured. Uh, a moonshot. Been waiting for one of those for a while. That was beautiful. Um, okay, so all the songs I've been listening to on this channel so far, they have most of them have had some kind of like a, a, a quicker tempo to them. Um, this was probably the closest to uh, what I would consider a ballad that I've listened to so far on this channel, and I think that they crushed that. I think that that was. Uh, I, I liked that one better than Egotistic, I think. Uh, not The song structure was very unique. It was very different. They had uh, percussion dropping out. They had uh, different vocal arrangements throughout the course of the song. It was just switching up over and over again. All of the singers showed that they can actually belt one real high notes and also do that real low kind of... Um, that stable low note that is really hard for a lot of um, high-pitched singers to do just because it's so far away from their normal vocal range. Uh, the girl with the, the dark hair, she was probably the best at that. That was uh, vocally extraordinarily impressive, creative songwriting, and it did what I wanted it to do, which was make me want to hear more Mamamoo. Guys, thank you for joining me once again. Uh, the next video is going to be the music video, the animated music video for the KDA Pop Stars video. Uh, I already did the live reaction. If you haven't seen that, go check it out. Uh, this time I want to actually see what these avatars are capable of doing in a music video setting. Like, comment, subscribe. Annyeong.